Not too many fortunes like yours these days. Forty-two million, seventy-seven thousand, three hundred and twenty-eight dollars and fifty-three cents. And fifty-three cents. <laughs> You're a hell of a bookkeeper, Daddy. Barbara, don't swear. It's not ladylike. Now, when you add to that your inheritance from your mother, your net worth will be in the neighborhood of fifty million dollars. For a man. Oh, anyone we know. Barbara. How much is it, anyway? It's a little over $10,000, madam. Barbara, you are embarrassing me. We do not discuss money in front of shop people. Oh, you don't. I didn't know. Okay, let's go somewhere and discuss it in private. The Catherine the Great Tiara. Cartier acquired it a few months ago. I have been saving it for you, Countess. Oh, it's magnificent. You must have it, of course. Oh, Jules, I can't. They're attacking me all over New York. With one stroke of the pen, I alienated an entire nation. No matter what you do, they'll attack you. But you're in Paris now. Everyone loves you here. And those who don't, don't know you, so why bother with them? For you, Countess, Cartier is prepared to settle for just over one million. Oh. And, of course, perhaps, uh... And, of course, you, you will want it, Tiara. You've been a good girl, haven't you? Nobody seems to think so. <laughs> <laughs> but even if I had, would it matter? I'll take it. Every holiday, every summer, I'll take you to magic castles, ancient forts. How would it be with you? Lance, I'm just not the kind of mother who can live in Tucson, Arizona. I'm sorry. My dearest Lance, I miss you so much and wish I could hold you now. Now, when the world is back celebrating, you should be my escort. Soon, darling, stay healthy. I love receiving your letters. Until the next one. Oh, my love, mommy. I'm nervous. Yeah, so was I the first time I met her. But you'll get used to her. Come on, Mom doesn't like me to be late. I slipped. Yeah. You've been doing a lot of that lately. Let's go, Sally. Lance. Come on. Lance. Lance. I sold the Cuernavaca house. How much? Five hundred thousand. I spent three and a half million on it. Different market, Barbara. Different partner this time, Graham. I don't know what you're talking about. Did you sell the house to yourself? And a partner is a cover. Did you sell my flat in Paris to the same partner? I think you've been staging a garage sale for 20 years. Almost all of my jewelry. Most of my property. Liquid assets, they call it. I think you're a drowning man. It's nearly all gone, isn't it?
Don't look so glum, kid. I am about to spray a couple million for you. Doctors inhabit the first circle of hell. Lawyers, the second. Did I ever tell you what I think of you, Graham? I think you are the biggest con artist I've ever met. Now get out of here. Bring me a necklace. Which one, princess? The only one I have left. He must see me in my pearls. at the age of 66 and was placed in the Woolworth crypt next to her mother and her son. At the time of her death, Barbara Hutton had less than $3,500 on deposit in her bank accounts. 